Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, upon 1.2 release, the World 7 of Simulated Universe has dropped. I think some of you might be stuck on this new Simulated Universe because the new boss, this new deer boss is very very annoying to me. And for me personally, on my free-to-play account, I was having a difficult time to clear this boss at high difficulty. Um, simply because I do not have enough damage to either kill the boss in time or before he kills me by what by the explosion one shot in the last phase and the constant heal is so annoying as well so i've been playing around with different builds and found this this um build i'm pretty sure this is not a new build people probably already discussed this already um on other channel but this build is very very strong against this boss and i would say this build can also be very strong against any other boss as well so here is i'm gonna bring you with this build and before we dive into it uh just a quick checkup on my prepare account the gears to show that everyone is idle on zero and the gear is very average i would say and then they're also using a free to play weapon as well for all of them and here is the build i'm using it is the full remembrance path and basically it's a freezing path that um, work around the dissociation damage to kill the enemy and also constantly freezing the enemy so that they cannot really do much damage to you and you're gonna destroy them so fast if you get the right combo of the blessings i'm gonna show you the blessings on the screen right now here so the key blessings you need to get for this build is the one shown on screen here the three star blessing that allow you whenever you attack a frozen enemy you will have a chance to apply dissociation to the enemy for one turn and this dissociation is where your all the damage comes from from this build. It's gonna carry you to clear the entire simulated universe without any damage from your DPS on your team. And you are still able to clear it from just this dissociation damage alone. And the second one, this one is the second priority where every five times you attack the enemy, you will have a 150% base chance to freeze the enemy. And this will just basically ensure that you will pop that as dissociation because the dissociation is given by the enemy already frozen at first and then you attack that frozen enemy and next up we have this two star blessing which is not necessary if you just want to clear but if you get it it's going to massively increase your damage overall and speed up your entire run clear time so it says attacking the enemy with dissociation will remove that dissociation and do the damage equal to 150% of the dissociation removal damage. This is very insane damage. But the downside is that you attack it once and you'll remove that dissociation debuff, right? But now by having the second buff where after dissociation is removed from an enemy and there is a 50% base chance to freeze the enemy again. And then combine this with the three star blessing where you attack a frozen enemy, you will make them become dissociation again. So this is like an infinite loop combo for this build. And lastly, you want to get 10 Remembrance Blessings so that you will unlock two of the Path Resonance Enhanced Blessings shown on the screen here. Um, the first one, it will apply a debuff to the enemy whenever you use your Path Resonance skill, which basically extend the freeze direction from one turn to two turns. And the second one, it increases your, your path resonance regeneration speed every time you freeze the enemy. And because dissociation is count as a type of freezing, so that means every time you apply dissociation, you will also recharge your path resonance skill by 5% energy. That means you're going to recharge your path resonance skill very, very fast to a point where after two turns of freezing, you basically your path resonance is ready up again. To use so you can infinitely freeze them so that's all about it about this build i hope this build helps you to clear war 7 of the highest difficulty if you are stuck with and thank you so much all for watching this video and i hope to see you in the next one bye bye